Hey guys, it's Horse2 Tony here. Today's video, we're doing an ace video with the P61C1. This one's a good short one. It's only once the fighting actually starts, it gets insane. It gets insane real fast, get kills real quick. I end up dying at the end of this, but I did work for my team getting the ace. Five kills. People were like, oh, good job, P61. I'm like, this thing's a beast. I did nothing. The plane flew itself. <sighs> but what is to be said about the P61? The P61 is a great plane as a 4.0 BR. It has great firepower, great speed, great maneuverability, and a great climb. And it, the climb gets even better because you have an air spawn. So you're already going 250 plus miles per hour in freedom units starting at a higher altitude so all you got to do with this baby as you're going to see in the video coming up shortly is you just kick it to a 15 degree climb and you climb you're going to be higher than most things that are in the air a lot of times you're either higher than the 109s or you're on the same level with them so for those of you that haven't flown this blessed sky whale or have an or have had the unfortunate opportunity to run into one here are some reasons why you should fear this thing. It has four 20 millimeter cannons stuffed right in the, they're not really in the nose, they're still center mounted. They're a little bit back, like kind of on the body of the plane. And to top that off is it has 450 cals on top that you can use offensively and defensively. And with the speed, the rate of climb, and the maneuverability of the sky wheel, you can't be stopped. You, you can't be stopped. It can take some punishment sometimes. You can either just get hit by a truck and just keep going, or you get hit once and your whole rear section blows off. It's real iffy. Uh, I don't know about the damage model on it. But why to fear this thing? It is potent at heads on, at, on head on attacks. With those four uh, 20 millimeters, I think they're ANM2 cannons. They shoot really fast, they're really accurate. Just one of those things hits you, you're pretty much done, let alone the three other that are coming at you. As the ability to climb, so what I usually do is I take a, I boom and zoom with this. I pretty much strictly boom and zoom unless I know I got the upper hand. Other than that, boom and zoom with this baby. You can turn when need to, but it's not advised because you still have around a 25 second turn time. So you're not going to be out turning 109s unless they're very slow or anything like that. But you can do it. It's just very situational. Well, let's get to this video. I was not expecting to get an ace. I was actually listening to music. That's why this part's all cut out. Uh, listening to some stuff. I highly doubt anyone else would want to listen to. Um, this was cut out. We see this 109 right here. I don't think he's seen me. And I think he wanted to go after this B-25, and I think he sees me when it's too late. I think right about here is when he sees me, because he tries to pull stuff, and then just, boop, one-tapped him. That, that was a very lucky shot. I didn't think I was going to hit it. That's why I only shot one burst, is because I thought I was just going to miss. And then, like I said, guys, we're booming and zooming, so we're climbing straight back up. We're going to climb. I look over to my right, I see this huge mass of enemy planes. For some weird reason, the whole enemy team, they go low and they're all like in this area. <laughs> Sorry about the baby scream, he demands he sits on my lap while I edit this video. So back to what I was saying, the whole enemy team is in this area, they all went low even knowing they were Germany. I could understand the yaks and the spitfires, maybe the spitfires could climb, but I didn't know why they were this low. So I take advantage of this. I thought at least one or two of them right here were going to pitch up and try to get me. Because like I said earlier, I'm a big target. I'm hard to miss. But for some weird reason, they must have seen I was flying fast as hell, grease lightning, and they didn't want none of this P-61. My only other worry while I was doing this was that F-190 uh, coming over and swooping me up while I'm doing this. Because I put myself in a real dangerous situation. If there was any anybody was paying attention, they could have climbed up and got me, especially when I went straight inverted and came back down. But right here is what every P-61 pilot wants to see. A whole bunch of enemies close, not paying attention to you. So I'm trying to pick my target here. I decide I'm going to shoot at this J-21A1. He tries to do a little maneuvers. I miss my first shots. 
this is where being able to turn in the P61C1 works out for you because I didn't commit to like a full turn fight with him. It has enough mobility that I was able to get enough lead to get him. Light him on fire. This was a dangerous situation for me. I thought I was gonna die because I've been in those situations where someone comes a little bit lower and you just can't get your guns on target. And I thought I was gonna rip my wings here. You actually see me pull my air brakes not to die. I don't, if I wouldn't have pulled my air brakes, I'm pretty sure I would have died right there. And then that J21, he didn't want to stay dead. He wanted me dead. And then, so we're going to line up on this Yak-9, take a couple good shots, dip out. Here, I, I'm pretty sure I pissed off the enemy team. They want me dead. They want this guy well dead. So I'm going to go inverted. Got the kill assist on him with my 50 cals, and that's where they can be. That's where they can be defensive for you. Someone gets behind you, as long as they don't go underneath your rudder, you can hit them. And if you fly the P61, I hope you're good with guns. Because that's where it really shines, is when you can use, if you use your 20 millimeters, miss, and then turn, go inverted, and then use your 50s. It's a great combination, just like I did here. He ends up messing me up, and he gets the kill. He's gonna end up killing me because I can't pull out, guys. But that's the quick ace for you guys. If you noticed, that was short, quick, and to the point. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. Baby, I'm a monster, a monster. I've been working till my brain's off.